Hey guys, welcome to Jiva Yoga Live. My name is Claire. Today we're doing a sequence all about yoga poses for nose blockages to relieve any congestion that we have going on. So grab your mat and join me now. All right guys, we are going to start on our mats. So yoga for nose blockages. We wanna release any tension that we have, any congestion that we have in our face, in our nose, and in our chest. So we're gonna start on our mat today in easy pose. So just sitting cross-legged position, removing any extra flesh underneath your sitting bones to promote a nice healthy spine. We're gonna start just by grounding ourselves so you can bring your hands to your lap here, close your eyes, Smile to yourself to relieve any stress. Just take a big breath in, lengthening your spine up nice and tall, and relaxing your shoulders as you exhale out. Breathing in, just grounding yourself to the mat, and breathing out, connecting to your body. So we're going to start with a little pranayama to release any congestion in our nose here. So we're going to do breath of fire or Kalabhati breath. So this is focusing on the exhale. So we're going to breathe in and out through our nose, which might seem a little hard, but I promise you it won't. And if anything, just slow down. And if you need a breath through the mouth, totally okay. So for breath of fire, we're going to focus on the exhale about pushing out through our nose and then pulling your belly in so it's almost like you pull your belly back and up so you exhale like hard out through the exhale of the nose the inhale will come naturally so just try it for a moment here in taking a breath in to prepare and then exhaling breath of fire So as you exhale, you pull your belly back, exhaling out the air. The inhale will come naturally through your nose. Don't panic if it's just little. And then exhale completely. So we'll do it for about 20 seconds here and then we'll rest. So you can bring your hands to your lap here. You can close your eyes focusing on the third eye or take your gaze to your nose. Breath in and exhale out. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, breath of fire. Breathe in and breathe out. Bring one hand to your heart and one to your belly. Close your eyes and make that connection. You might feel a little tinglingness or a little sensations in the face, light dizziness. That's totally okay. Just bring one hand to your heart and one to your belly and ground yourself down. So breath of fire, we want to build that internal heat in that body. And by doing that, that's going to release any mucus that you have congested in the nose any blockages that you have. So we wanna build that heat to help loosen that. And when you feel ready and connected, release your hands down by your side. And you can do another few rounds of that if that's calling to you, but we're gonna move on and do a little bit of face yoga. So we are going to use our two fingers of both of our hands here. We wanna relieve that congestion in our throat. So we're first gonna use these two fingers of both hands and gently tap the area around our nose. And by doing this, we're going to increase the blood circulation, inviting fresh oxygen and healthy areas. So around the T-bone, around the nose, the cheeks, and a little bit up through the eyebrows promoting fresh collagen here, just waking up the system, creating some extra room for that mucus to move through. And then after about 20 seconds of that, we are going to use the same two fingers, and this time we're gonna start on the inside of our eyebrows here. So from the inner eye, but just slightly up. And then we are going to gently push into our skin, pulling down underneath our eyes a little bit to the sides of our nose and then gently pushing it out. So we wanna press into the sides of our nose and pull out through our cheeks. Press in, 
and pull out. And by this, we're increasing the lymphatic system, helping drainage through our nose. And we'll do this about 20 times, pressing into the inner eyes and then down through the sides of our nose. You can do this as fast or as slow as feels good. Just focus on draining that lymphatic system here. And then releasing your hands down by your sides here. Take a breath in and exhale out. So we're starting to wake up the mind, the breath, and the nose here, relieving that mucus. So staying in easy pose here, we're going to reach both of our hands up towards the sky. We're going to drop our right hand towards the back in between our shoulders and use our left hand to grab for our right elbow. Coming into cow face pose with a variation here, coming into this tricep stretch. Here we're strengthening and stretching the lungs, opening up the respiratory system, breathing in and breathing out. Focus on opening up that chest here, stretching and strengthening, inhale and exhale. Breathe in, reach both hands up towards the sky and then switching sides, left hand goes towards the back in between the shoulder blades, right hand to your left elbow, open up your chest, ground down through your sitting bones, breathe in to lengthen and exhale to deepen, open your chest, relaxing your gaze or closing your eyes here. Release both hands, inhale as you reach your hands up, and then exhale your hands to heart center here. Beautiful job, guys. So we're gonna flip over onto our hands and knees, coming into downward facing dog to start. So press into all 10 fingers, send your legs out long behind you, and then send your hips up towards the sky as you melt your heels down towards the ground. Taking a nice big breath in, lengthening through the side body, stretching the rib cage and the lungs, the organs. This is gonna improve circulation in the respiratory system, helping clear that mucus. And exhale out. Shift your weight forward, coming into a high plank position. So your shoulders are stacked over your wrist, hips in line with your shoulders and heels over your toes. Bend your knees on towards the ground here. Bend your elbows at 90 degrees. Flip onto the tops of the toes here. Press into your palms. Lift your thighs off the mat, coming into upward facing dog. So for here, we want our shoulders over our wrists. Our thighs are lifted. Tops of the toes and towards the earth. Gaze slightly up. Lengthen the back of your neck. This is stretching the front of your chest. Breathe in. Flip your toes over. Downward facing dog. Exhale it out. We're gonna do that one more time. So shifting our weight back forward, coming into that high plank, bending our knees on towards the mat, bend your elbows, tops of the toes in towards the ground here. Exhale out your air, press into the tops of the toes, into your palms, lift your chest up, inhale, upward facing dog. Beautiful, hang out here for just a moment, really stretching and opening up the chest. We wanna increase the respiratory system and circulation in our chest. And exhale, downward facing dog. Flip your hips over and send your hips up. Bend your knees and gently come back on towards the mat here. Walk your hands towards your center body. And now we are going to move into camel pose. So I'm gonna fold my mat a little bit just to help give my knees a little bit of cushion. So moving into camel pose. Aiding, you can always use a towel or a, if that feels good, or just fold your mat. So coming into camel pose, we're opening and stretching our chest here. So we're gazing back slightly, arching our chest, really stretching that lungs in our body here, opening up that respiratory system. So we're gonna start with our hands down by our sides, exhaling out our air, reaching your hands up towards the sky. Really focus on lengthening the spine here. This will help you go back deeper. First by lengthening the spine, gaze up, and then slowly arch your back, send your hips forward, gently squeeze your glutes, and then when you find your depth, bring your hands to your lower spine here, push down your skin to increase the space in your lower back, keep your gaze up, open up your chest, maybe stick out your tongue, hiss it out, 
One more breath here, inhale. Exhale it out. Bend your knees and slowly bring your hips back down towards your glutes and then bring your chin back in line as the last thing. That's gonna help balance you back out. Bring one hand to your heart, one to your belly. Camel pose is a super juicy heart opener. Increasing the circulation in our chest and our nose to remove any mucus that we have. And then coming back to the center, we can release the mat to send it back long. Face the front of your mat here. And so this is all about promoting, clearing the blockages of mucus in our nose. Thank you guys for watching. Namaste. Thank you for joining us here at Jiva Yoga Life. If you enjoyed today's video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos. Namaste.